Hello there, welcome to this day YouTube channel and in this video, I want to show you how to download and install the drama player on your Fire Stick device. This is going to be a long and full guide video, so make sure to watch the video right up to the end. And if you find it helpful, make sure to like, subscribe and share for more important videos like this. So in this video, I will be showing you the full guide to download and install a drama player on your Fire Stick device. And I'll be showing you every single step you need to follow. So please watch the video attentively and follow the instructions I show you on my screen. That's it, let's get started. Here's my Fire Stick device. And if I go over to my App Store and search for the drama player, I wouldn't see it. So that's why I need to show you a different method to install the application because it's not on the App Store. So the very first step you need to do is installing an application called Downloader. To install downloader, go over to find and click on the search box over here and type in downloader or just simply D. On the type in D, you are going to get the suggestion for downloader and here's it over here. Click on the suggestion and install the application to your Fire Stick device. For this, this is the easiest application to download in this process that I will be showing you here. So click on download and that way it's going to start downloading. Once it's done downloading automatically, it's going to start installing to your Fire Stick device and the application is going to quickly install and then you can go ahead and launch it but wait a minute we are not yet launching the application because you have some steps to complete before getting to that level so after downloading and installing the application what you need to do is to return once you return home now there is something you need to do on your Fire Stick every new Fire Sticks are set to not allow you to install applications for unknown sources. That means that if you take your new Fire Stick and try to install applications for unknown sources, it is not going to work. There is an option for that. I need to turn that option on before you can be able to install applications for unknown sources to your Fire Stick. And let me show you how to turn that option on. It is very simple. On your Fire Stick device, go over to your settings. Here's mine over here. Go to the settings that says My Fire TV. On these settings, there is an option of develop options, as you can see on my screen. Now, in your case, this option might not pop up. Let me show you what to do if you don't see this option. If you don't see this option, come back to the option that says About, click on it, and on the name of your Fire Stick, mine is Fire TV Stick 4K. On the name of yours, click on it five times. Until there's a pop-up below that says no need, you are already a developer. Once you see that pop-up, then the developer option has been turned on. And what you need to do is to go over to the option. And on this second option, this is what we are interested in. This is the feature or the option on your Fire Stick that allows you to install applications for unknown sources or not. If this option is turned on, you will be able to install applications for unknown sources. If it is not turned on, you wouldn't be able so what you need to do is to go over here and make sure that this option is turned on. Once it's turned on, you can then now return and you are good to go. Your Fire TV now can then install applications for unknown sources. And we've done two important steps already. We've installed the downloader and we've turned on the developer option to allow you to install applications for unknown sources. So that's it. Let's go over to the next step. Go over to the downloader and launch it. And to use downloader, what you need to do is to type in codes in the downloader boxes to install applications. So go over here and type in a code to install an application. So in this case, the application I want to install is called APK Time, and the code to install it is 21254. So here's the code. Just go over here and type in the code 21254. And once I don't type it, just go ahead and launch Go. Once you type Go, this is what is going to happen. It is going to bring you to a page that is going to install an application called APK Time. I will tell you why this application is very important and why I'm, I'm showing you to install the application. But just go over to this page and come to the option that says download and click on download. Once you click download, the application is going to start downloading to your Fire Stick device. Once it's done downloading, it is going to install or we are going to install it to our Fire Stick device. So follow attentively. The application is downloaded, click on install. And the application is going to be installed to a Fire Stick device. It's called APK Time. Once it's done installing, click Delete that file, then you return home. 
and we'll install the application called APK Time. As I said, I will tell you why it is important to install this application. Just go over here and launch the application. The reason why installing this application is because this is a mini app store and this is an alternative to your app store. What do I mean? If there are applications you are searching on your app store and you cannot find them, then this application might have these applications that you're searching for. So just go over here and there are different categories of applications that you, you might be interested in. But go over here, choose the category that you want. You're going to see applications that you can install to your Fire Stick device. So this is why this application is a mini app store that you can use on your Fire Stick device to install applications. So just go over here and take out your time and browse through the applications that you, you will see here. And if you like any, then go ahead and install. So that's it. This is an application called APK Time and it's very important to use on your Fire Stick device. So why show you how to download and install Drama Player? I've also shown you how to install a mini app store you can use on your Fire Stick to install applications that you don't find on your app store. So we're interested in the installing the Drama Player and I'm going to show you how to install Drama Player to your Fire TV. So that's it. Go over to the option that says Players and Browsers. Since we're looking for the Drama Player, the Drama Player is going to be under the category of Players and Browsers. So go over here and browse through until you see the application for Drama Player. So here's it over here, Drama Player. And there are two options. There's a 64-bit and there's a 32-bit. Now you need to know which one is your TV or which one is for your TV. So mine is the 32-bit and it's this option over here. So go over here and click on download on this second option because that's the one that's going to work on my Fire TV device. So I'll click download and the application is going to start downloading to my Fire TV device. So here's it, it's going to take a couple of seconds. The download speed depends on your internet speed. If yours is fast, it should be faster than mine. So once the application is downloaded, we can go ahead and install to our Fire TV device. So just give it a second and here, here the application will be downloaded. Click on install and then we are going to install the application to our Fire TV device by just clicking install and wait. And that's how to download and install this application to your Fire TV device without using your App Store. If you found the video helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and share for more important videos like this. So now the application is downloaded, you can then return home and you are going to see the application somewhere here. So you go over here, this is the application, and as you can see, here is it over here. So this is just a player, please. This application does not have any content that you need to watch. What you need to do is go over here and put in the URL to the, the content you need to watch before you can play. This application is just a player and it does not provide any content, no uh, videos that you need to watch. So this is how to download and install this application. If you find it helpful, make sure to like, subscribe and share for more important videos like this.